Hello and welcome to Cruise News for June 1st, 2020. Canada has taken the steps to block cruise ships from docking in Canadian ports through October 31st, 2020. This will have the unfortunate effect of canceling the Alaskan cruise season unless the pride of America transitions to Alaska for the season. This goes hand in hand with Hawaii stating they do not expect to open cruising until the second half of 2021. Given the Pride of America is the only U.S. flagged cruise ship, it could potentially sail from Seattle to Alaska and back if Seattle opens its cruise port in time. Copenhagen has sadly put its new cruise terminal, which was expected to be built by 2020, on pause due to the current change in passenger traffic. Bahamas Paradise plans to resume cruising at the end of July on the Grand Celebration. They will be cruising with new health protocols in place and under 60% capacity. If you're not familiar with Bahamas Paradise, they cruise back and forth from Florida to Bahamas. Check out the vlog Paradij did for a great overview of the experience. We will include the link in the show notes. Akin to listening to the radio for school district closures on snow days, here's a list of all of the current cruise canceling extensions that were sadly announced this week. Viking Cruise Line has canceled the remainder of its summer cruise program by canceling cruising now through the end of August 2020. Morella, which is operated by TUI in the UK, has postponed sailings through the end of July given the current travel restrictions still in place. Ada has extended its cruise sailing through the end of July 2020. Costa Cruises has extended its cruise operations through July 2020. And Celestial Cruises, which does a lot in Europe, especially Greece, has canceled sailings through the end of July. Please do remember to hit the subscribe button on whatever podcasting software you're using. And if you can leave a review on whatever platform you use, that would be great.